السلام علیکم جی برادرز اینڈ سسٹرز اینڈ ویلکم ٹو قرآن ان اسلام وی ہوپ یو آر پریپیئرنگ ویل فار یور آخرا بلیونگ ان دا ڈے آف ججمنٹ از ون اسٹرانگ پلر آف آر ایمان اٹ کمپلیٹس آر دین بٹ ایز ہیومنس ہیو یو ایو ونڈرڈ وین ایگزیکٹلی ول دا لاسٹ آر ہیپن دا قرآن ہیز کلیئرلی اسٹیٹڈ دیٹ دس نالج ریسٹ اونلی ود اللہ آل مائی ایز ٹو وین ول دا لاسٹ ڈے ہیپن But the Qur'an, Hadith, and the previous books have given us some hints and prophecies. When they are fulfilled, mankind should expect the Akhirah. One of the signs in the Bible is that dead bats will fall from the sky. In the chapter Zephaniah in Bible, it has been stated that, I will sweep away man and beast. I will sweep away the birds of the sky and the fish of the sea. I will make the wicked stumble and I will destroy mankind from the face of the earth. Can you believe that it just recently happened and the Jews are extremely worried about this? An Israeli news channel reported that dozens of dead bats have fallen out of the sky in a region called Pards Cats in Israel. The local farmers captured photos and videos of those bats and posted on social media which immediately went viral. Many of the bats are young and show no signs of trauma or injury. Another Facebook user said they had seen the dead bats in the city of Hadera, some 50 kilometers away from the bats' cats. Jews and the state of Israel are already preparing hard for the end of times. And even harder now, after so many prophecies have come true. Brothers and sisters, Today we see that Israel has built a strong army. It is all ready to take over the Masjid Al-Aqsa, demolish it and build the Hekel of Soleimani for their king, Dajjal. Some news even say that the state of Israel got a warrant issued and soon they will start the demolition process. The only thing in their way is the United Nations, which restricts the demolition of sacred and cultural places of other ethnicities. All this so that they could take over the Masjid Al-Aqsa, build the Hekel of Soleimani and find the Taboot of Sakina. Also, have you seen the trees of Gharqat that Jews have been planting all over the Israel? Do you know that planting this tree is also part of their preparation for the last hour? As the Hadith clearly said, the last hour would not come unless the Muslims will fight against the Jews and the Muslims will would kill them until the Jews would hide themselves behind a stone or a tree and a stone or a tree would say Muslim or the servant of Allah there is a Jew behind me come and kill him but the tree Gharqat would not say for it is the tree of the Jews all the minor signs of the last hour have been fulfilled and according to an authentic hadith when the minor signs have been fulfilled Imam Mahdi will appear in no time and all the remaining major signs will show themselves rapidly just like the beads of a broken rosary. It is high time that we look at our deeds again, reconsider them and see if they are good enough to be presented in front of Allah on the last day. May Allah grant us the tawfiq to be better Muslims. Ameen. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel and hit the bell icon so that you don't miss an update till next time assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh